The 8th Marine Airborne Regiment jump out the doors of their aircraft and float serenely down to earth. 200 French paratroopers are jumping here from their A400M aircraft and the planes have flown direct to Estonia from their military bases in France to practice the speed at which they need to move for a real operational air insertion. And we have this fairly new aircraft, uh, A400, which allow us to take off from France, fly a few hours, like I said, and, and parachute uh, in a different country. Like within, within a night you can drop uh, uh, one, two coils, uh, whatever. Uh, in, a, in a case of a crisis somewhere. The paratroopers are here specifically for exercise spring storm. But France maintains a permanent deployment in Estonia of around 350 servicemen and women who work closely with 900 British troops. The UK provide the armour, the French the infantry. Armour is one thing, infantry is a way to hold the terrain so you have the fight with the, with the, with the big uh, armour and then the infantry, I would say, is complementary. France shares the UK view that Estonia and NATO's eastern borders are a top priority. Being on the eastern flank of Europe and given the strategic situation now, it's our priority. And you can see that through our troops because we bring the French Foreign Legion and also you can see that uh, with our equi equipments because, like I said, the Griffin is like the brand new jowl of France. The Griffin has proven itself in high tempo operations in the desert in Mali and earlier in the year in sub-zero temperatures here in Estonia. This is an infantry fighting vehicle, so it is a French infantry fighting vehicle. Uh, you, we have uh, 20 of them here in Estonia. And uh, here you are inside a, a command post version, so from here we can uh, uh, receive the order uh, from uh, the battle group and deliver the order to the French subunit that is under the under command of the battle group. The high-tech onboard data system means information can be shared in real time between vehicles and commanders. It's no surprise the Griffin has attracted admiring glances from UK service personnel. Everyone can enter the Griffin and uh, we can share uh, the information, we can share some, uh, have some discussion, some chatting with everyone inside. It's not a problem. At the end of the parachute drop, two French A400M aircraft buzz the drop zone. The new planes and equipment, a sign of France's resolute commitment to the region. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe.